Welcome to my channel. I've been asked to react to Quake Matthews singing Roses. That's got to be a stage name. Nobody names their child Quake, right? Well, maybe if they live in San Francisco, they do. <laughs> anyway, that's what I'm going to do now. But before I do that, I want to thank you for coming to my channel, for watching my videos, for supporting me. Thank you very much. And I do want to remind you that I put the links to the artists in the description field of my video. And I hope that you will support the artists that I feature by subscribing to their YouTube channel, by following them on social media, and by buying their music if you like their music. So this is Quake Matthews singing Roses. Give me my roses for I take them by force. Get my shovel out and dig them up straight from the source. Fuck the run around, I'm running around waging a war. Cause this shit a dirty game when you play with remorse. Shit is strange and it's hard trying to move with a humble heart. But karma is a bitch and you know she'll fuck you raw. I seen people switch soon as money become involved. Close friends that I'm forced now to love from afar. Plus I'm getting texts from my exes just supposedly to check in and seem innocent. Though I know they fuck me if I I let them, but I'm disciplined Can't nobody come between my family, not a little bit I'm a father figure, can't afford to be a hypocrite They say the world is like a stage Or better yet a zoo, keep your hand up out that cage They want me making choices out of rage But I'm tame, and I don't rest on my laurels So my morals never change I got the smoke still blowing in my trunk Still knocking half drunk while I'm rolling around I feel the sun still shining and my skin still glowing Showing no signs of slowing it down so give me my praises for my body cold stiff six feet in the ground I need my roses right now They say dead people receive more roses than living ones Cause regret is stronger than gratitude But I kept it real this whole fucking time I need my shit right now this is for the ones who kept it real, no matter how people feel Even if you look weak, when you was just trying to heal Situation was bleak and you kept it moving through hell So take these roses from me, cause you made the choice to prevail That's G, and this is for anybody who failed Trying to do the right thing, while the devil was on your tail For anybody penning them letters up in that jail Trying to find a bit of heaven in that cell I see you, for single mothers working them double shifts Trying to raise your kids in that building where trouble lives Window in that alley decorated with blood and piss Fifth grade teacher calling saying your son at risk I swear that you got this shit They say the world is like a stage Or better yet a zoo Keep your hand up out that cage They want me making choices out of rage But I'm tame and I don't rest on my laurels So my morals never change I got the smoke still blowing in my trunk Still knocking half drunk while I'm rolling around I feel the sun still shining in my skin Still blowing showing no signs of slowing it down Praises for my body cold, stiff six feet in the ground I need my roses right now Okay, uh, this is hip hop, right? I think it, it's rap mixed with music is hip hop, is that right? I think it is. Anyway, um, I thought he did a decent job. I, I, I was struck by the uh, line where he sung about how uh, people give more roses to the dead than they do the living uh, because they regret. <laughs> so true. 
and uh, you know I've made it a habit in my life to to praise people while they're alive so for example if I if I for example I went to uh, the hospital on uh, let's see it was last Friday for a procedure and um, I thanked every single one of the nurses and and other people that waited on me and that took care of me um, you know, it's just, I, I, I don't, I don't give false praise. I don't thank someone if they didn't do a good job. Uh, but if they did, they deserve to hear about it. And they so seldom do. Mostly what people will do is complain. And very seldom will they ever praise someone. So, you know, just maybe make it a part of your life. If something if someone does something that you notice whether they're doing it for you or for someone else and you think that they did a good job at it and that they were conscientious and that they were helpful then tell them uh, you know I took my wife to the to the uh, uh, retina doctor recently and uh, the girl that was uh, checking us in had a really nice weave and her smile was beautiful. So you know what I did? I said, you know what, Janet? I said, you have a beautiful smile and I really like your hair the way you did it. And she just lit up. That's what it will do for people. It will light them up because they don't hear that very much from even the people that they live with and that they love, you know? So maybe just take the time in your life to say something nice to somebody without any expectation of return. You never know what might happen. You know, sometimes, I'm, I'm going way off in the weeds now, but uh, sometimes in life, you can do things for someone and you will never know what it did for them. Occasionally, someone will tell you, do you remember when you did X, Y, or Z? that changed my life and you go really I I had no idea but you don't do it because you want to hear them say that you do it because it's the right thing to do and don't you think the world would be a better place if more of us were doing that so let's start a movement to praise people when they do good regardless of who they are regardless of whether you know them or not if someone looks nice tell them if someone treats you well, tell them. It doesn't cost you anything. And it can reap dividends beyond your imagination in the world. So, back to the, to the uh, piece. I, you know, <clears throat> for me this kind of song is kind of borderline because... I'm not a prude. I was in the Navy, so I, you know, <laughs> I know all about cussing. But I just would appreciate it if there was less of it in music. Uh, I understand that hip-hop, it's kind of like a part of the genre, and so you sort of have to do it whether you want to or not. But uh, I just wish there was less of it. But anyway, the message that he sang, uh, that we should give people their roses now, while they're still alive and they can appreciate it, is a valuable message and we should heed that. I pray for you that you will live a long life, that you will be healthy, that God will bless you with great abundance and that he will keep you safe from harm and that you will be born again if you're not already. I pray for the same thing for every person that you love. More than anything, I pray that you will be anxious for nothing, but in all things, through prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, you will let your requests be made known to God, and the peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. This is the Vietnam Era Vet, out.